Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to explore an exciting and cutting edge topic that is brain MRI segmentation using deep learning. In this video, I'll guide you through the entire process from understanding the unit architecture to a live demonstration and a code preview. So let's jump right in. To begin, let's take a closer look at the unit architecture. The unit architecture is a powerful convolutional neural network specifically designed for an image segmentation task. It was first introduced by researchers at the University of Freiburg and has since become widely adopted in the medical imaging field, particularly in the brain and MRI segmentation. The unit architecture comprises of encoders and the decoders and the encoder captures the contextual information from the input image and the decoder localizes the and classifies it, the regions of inter interest with its skip connections that is the gray arrows over shown over here the unit ar architecture can effectively combine two low level and high level features enabling accurate segmentation results so now let's move on to the ex most exciting part that is the live demonstration of the brain mri segmentation using the unit architecture this is the main page of our application and as soon as we will select a brain image like this the image will be ready to be segmented out i have prepared a data set of brain mri images and will use this image image data sets to train our unit model to segment out the tumor of out of the image and display it explicitly so let's predict the output as you can see the model was running right now and here is our tumor that is has been detected by our model as you can see the unit architecture delivers impressive segmentation accuracy allowing us to identify and differentiate various structures in the brain mri images as you can see over here the whole brain is in a dark gray type of color and the tumor that has been detected by our model is in a light gray color which we can see right now from the screen this technique has significant potential in medical research facilitating the quantitative analysis and aiding in diagnosing and monitoring neurological conditions for those interested in the code behind this implementation now i will provide a code preview in the description below you can find a, a link to the github repository where i have uploaded the complete code feel free to explore and modify it according to your specific requirements remember comprehending and implementing deep learning algorithms like unit requires a solid foundation in the neural networks and programming However, the possibilities and advancements in the medical imaging brought by the deep learning are truly exciting. One important note for you guys, in the near future, I will be launching a full tutorial video with step-by-step -step guide to brain MRI segmentation using the deep learning. It will provide an in-depth explanation of the entire process from dataset preparation to model evolution. So if you want to delve deeper into this fascinating topic make sure to subscribe my, to my channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated if you have any questions or suggestions please leave them in the comments below so let's go to the model implementation that we can see over here so this is our jupyter notebook named by notebook.ipynb that stands for ipython notebook so here we are importing the, all the libraries, including the TensorFlows, uh, CV2, and Scikit-learn, and many more. Importing the dataset, that is uh, the uh, LGG MRI segmentation that has been downloaded from Kaggle, which I'll show you in the full tutorial video. Here we are seeing some of the images or the glimpse of the dataset that we have downloaded. Pre uh, here we are going to pre-process the data and this all is the uh, augmentation part of our data set. These are the diagnosis, 
uh, or the normalization and the dye dye coefficients or you can say losses and optimizers of a neural network as you can see this is the unit architecture and which is one of the most crucial part of our this neural network so here this function unit defines the whole unit architecture that has been shown in this image later on will i'll guide you through the training of the unit model and then later on after this training we are going to plot our matrix and evaluate our model later on and last this is the moment of proof that is we are going to segment out the tumors out of our the data set and check the accuracy over here this is a python file named as app.py which is used for our front end so as you can see over here all others are all of the code is mentioned over here and i'll leave the link below in the description to check out for you guys so at last thank you so much and i'll see you in the upcoming full tutorial video till then stay curious and keep learning thank you